National Dog Day, and these are the dogs of Good Day Seattle. Hey, That's there's Bill's Mia. Love. Yeah. And those are my dogs, Mila and Magnus. Nice. <laughs> nice. Everybody Look at all looking these. so cute. So cute. Who is that little guy there? Uh, I don't know. These are, these these are like you know extended family here. Um, so uh, we want to talk now with uh, the head trainer of Bellevue's Zoom Room. And they know a thing or two about dogs, and I know they're celebrating National Dog Day. Uh, Haley Hopkins is with us. Hi there. Hi, how's it going, guys? Great. Okay, so you have some, some strategies on how to keep our dogs in shape, and we're, we're going to get to that in a moment. But, but what is the Zoom Room, and what does it offer dogs and, and their owners? Yeah, absolutely. So we're a positive reinforcement training facility. So we focus more so on reward based training. Uh, we build a quality connection between the handler and the dog. Excellent. So the Zoom Room offers some agility training as a way to keep our dogs in shape, maybe keep them really mentally active too. So talk to me about what that training involves. Absolutely. So we set up different obstacles um, and it's a great part of socialization, getting your dogs comfortable on equipment, whether it be an A-frame, a teeter or some jumps. It's great for mental stimulation. It's also great for learning how to communicate with your dog through body language. Uh, I imagine it, it's probably just good for their mind, too, to do stuff like this. Look at that little guy go. <laughs> oh, who, who's having the best day I ever? <laughs> That's awesome. So how the Absolutely. How, so this is Lola and Callie. Okay. So, so tell us good. about this course and, and how this came about and, and, and how the dogs, uh, you know, how they learned to do this. Yeah, absolutely. So we start with just the foundations and agility training. We get your dogs comfortable with the equipment. Um, we start by luring them over. And as they progress through, um, we start creating more challenging obstacles. What they're doing here is what we call throttles through the weaves. And as you can kind of see, they're communicating through body language. So we're focusing a lot on hand <laughs> signals, the way we step. So over here at Good Day Seattle, we have dogs of all different sizes. I got big dogs, Bill's got a smaller dog. So can a dog any size really participate here? Absolutely. We take dogs of all sizes, all breeds. And this is great for any kind of dog, even ages. Um, of course, an older senior dog, we want to lower the equipment, and we definitely want um, you to get approval through a veterinarian. But an old dog can definitely learn new tricks. Okay, so okay, so to, to your point, I mean, uh, this this seems a little high level to, to be doing at <laughs> yeah. home. But what would you recommend for for dog owners that would like to get their dogs a little bit better trained, like something simple we could do at home? Yeah, absolutely. Um, we're a big fan of puppy parkour, so taking them out and about, um, teaching them how to jump on different things, whether it be logs or um, surfaces that they're not used to touching. Um, this is how we kind of create a confident dog. Again, we start our agility with just getting them comfortable. Um, Lola here is a bit more advanced. Uh, she's, she's been working here for a while. Um, but just getting your dogs um, comfortable with touching novel objects is really going to be what uh, sets you guys up for success. Can we can we go back to those live pictures with Lola because um, so cute so I, smart. I know so and so agile you know that that's the thing so so you, you said that Lola has some practice at this how long has Lola been training there? Um, she's been training here for well we grand opened in May um, however we've done some work previous to that um, so it's been a couple years she's been working on this agility equipment here um, again it's, it's a lot of persistence and repetition and a lot of rewards what is rewarded <laughs> is repeated and what is repeated becomes habit oh, excellent so, there so, you go. so if people are interested and they want their little pup to be as smart as Lola here what can they do where can they go Absolutely. Well, you can come visit us here at Zoom Room. Um, we offer different agility classes for different age ranges. So if you have a puppy, we offer puppy agility for four to nine months. We lower the equipment to be easy on their growing bones. Um, and then we also offer uh, adult agility as well. So you hey, can come visit us here, whether it be group lessons or private lessons. So Haley, do you have the best job in the world or what? Oh, I have an amazing job. I have an amazing staff. I work with amazing dogs. I, I couldn't be luckier. Yeah, it looks like the dogs are having a blast as well. Haley Hopkins from Bellevue Zoom Room. Thanks for your time. Thank you so much, guys.